Hi, I'm Amy Berkowitz, and I am the columnist for the Crafts and Hobbies page. And today I'm going to wish you a happy Passover and show you how to make Elijah's cup. Right here is the finished product of Elijah's cup. Put the wine in here, and this would be all ready for him so he knew which cup was his when he came to your Passover Seder. Today I'm going to be making you happy that you ran out of toilet paper. This is how we make Elijah's cup. This is Elijah. I know he looks a little blank right now, but you would paint him any skin color that you'd like. I picked peaches and cream. Then I will uh, glue on eyes for him. And we would have like a face like this. So here's his googly eyes. And you dip a little bit of cotton in some pink paint. I'll show you how to do that just to give him a little blush so he looks pretty lively. <laughs> and you would dip that a couple of times on the plate so that it wouldn't be so bright, right? And then just dip it right onto his face, okay? And then you would do the hair. Now there's two ways of doing the hair. You could get doll hair, and that would be in any craft shop that you could buy that. And it's very easy to apply. All you would need is the glue gun, okay? And you would put a little bit of glue just on here. You'd cut a piece off of the hair, and it doesn't matter where you cut it. It's all going to come out the same. And you grab it so that it's completely you know, in a ball in your hand and just smoosh it on there. Uh, we put it on there. If you want to put cotton as his hair, you would just kind of work that cotton out so that it would look sort of spread out and billowy and then glue it on there so that you'd have some long hair. I would put a beard on him by gluing just a little piece of cotton on here for his mustache and then kind of working it out through here and gluing it on. So let's see if we could get a little bit of glue on there. And you could trim it accordingly, you know, you don't have to make him look like Santa Claus, but you could. And you make a little beard on there, he needs a little trim here. Okay. And then we're just going to make the bottom of the cup and I decided that he needed some sandals, so I just glue a piece of brown felt onto a piece of camel colored felt. And I would glue them right onto the, to the plastic bottom of the cup. And he's all set there, okay? And then finally you're going to glue the paper towel roll to the bottom of the cup. Make sure that you get some in the front because you want that to be strong. And you're going to press it down. When he's all done, you have to clothe him because, you know, we don't want him to be naked. Trim it accordingly so that he has a little bit of like a cape. Here he is, he's got his little cape. Put it in here. And now Elijah, when you invite him to your Seder, will know exactly which cup to go to to drink from and he'll feel welcome. Next column, we're going to be doing an Easter bunny basket out of flat clothespins, and we're gonna glue them onto the peanut can container, and we'll make a nice little bunny basket for the Easter bunny to see. So I wish you a happy Passover, and of course a happy Easter, and read the Crafts and Hobbies page every Thursday in the Times Herald Record and on recordonline.com.